You're installing mods, got everything you want to try, moved into the mod folder, you try running the game only to run into an error in Smappy. Now you're stuck, you can't move forward, and you have no idea what to do. Well, I can always try to help you if you're having trouble with one of the mods I'm covering. Sometimes it's best to extend your reach for helping hands. Today I'm going to show you how you can read Smappy logs and provide them to the Reddit Smappy community to get that extra help you need. Before we begin, please subscribe if you want to see more Stardew Valley mod content. For this, you you are going to need a Reddit account to join the Smappy community, which I'll link down below. This community is in an excellent resource if you're having trouble installing a mod and are unsure of what to do if you get an error in Smappy. I'm going to walk you through the steps of everything that you need to include in your post so that you can provide the people helping you the best opportunity to figure out how to solve your problem. The first thing we're going to want to prep is our Smappy log. To do that, we are going to want to go to the Smappy Log Parser website and follow the directions listed for our system. I'm going to walk you through the steps for a Windows user, but if you're on Android, Linux, Mac, or using the Windows Xbox app, they have instructions for each of these. So following the directions for Windows, we are first going to press the Windows and R keys at the same time. This will cause a run box to appear, and here we can copy paste this text, which you can either copy paste from the description below or directly from the Smappy log parser page. Now we're going to look for either the Smappy crash text file, if it exists, or the Smappy latest text file. Since I'm not having any problems crashing, I'm going to be providing the Smappy latest text file. We are then going to drag the file over to the Smappy log parser window. If you need to choose from file instead, you can copy paste the file location we used earlier into the file explorer window. With that done, we can click the save and parse log button and grab the URL it provides. We are now going to go make a reddit post so go to the smappy reddit which i'll link in the description below at the very top you'll see an option to create post we're going to click into that and it should take you to a page where you can start constructing your smappy post the very first thing we are going to do is paste the url we just got from the smappy log parser now we're going to write a short description of the error we are seeing you're going to want to provide as much detail as possible so i would also include all the other mods that you're using if the error you're seeing is a visual error in game you can also include screenshots if you need to. And that's it! You can now publish your post and hopefully somebody from the Stardew Valley Smappy community will be able to help you. If you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like to help this video reach others. I'll be posting a video eventually on the most common ways you can help solve your Stardew Valley modding issues, as well as an updated guide on how to install mods using a very useful tool. So don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out. I'm Yoria, hopefully this video was helpful to you. Let me know in the comments below what other useful mod videos you'd like to see, or if you have a mod that you'd like to see spotlighted, let me know that as well. Until then, you can check out some of my other videos here. I hope to see you again. Until then, take care.